Hey, this is Jimmy Black. I'm here in Rockin' America in Oklahoma City where it is raining cats and dogs outside right now. I'm with the singer from Warrant. How's everything going, man? Very well. How are you? I'm great, man. Uh, you guys played a hell of a set tonight, man. Uh, everybody was really, really into it. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, we just want to go out and have as much fun as possible. Okay. So um, how long have you, got, have you been with the band now? It'll be two years in September. Two years in September? So a couple of months away from being two years. Having a blast? As always. Absolutely. Now yeah. you guys seem to have a, you know, just a great time. I mean, the vibe was really good. You had a lot of a lot of kids in the in the audience, you know, singing along and everything. Uh, how does it feel to look out and see a couple of generations of fans? Kids and their parents. It's cool. I mean, the people that lived through it the first time, you know, some of them have kids now, and because of Guitar Hero and everything else like that, you know. And that's definitely brought a lot of uh, a spotlight onto uh, some of the music these kids may not have heard. You know, you've got six-year-olds in the audience singing Cherry Pie. That know all the words. That's crazy. So what's next for you guys? I mean, you're going to be doing a little bit of touring, and then uh, what's, are you guys going to be doing any recording or anything? We're running around the country now doing uh, doing some fly dates throughout the summer and, and fall, and we're writing a record as it, you know, as it comes out of us, it comes out of us. There's no real, we have we have a deal, but there's no deadline, no pressure. And that's great. That and we, it's so much easier to put out a nice organic album. We kind of set it up that way because we knew what we had, what we were in for, right. and we really just want to uh, make it right. When it's done, it's done. I yeah. mean, I, it's not a. I hate to say it that way. It doesn't. I'm not saying that in a bad way. No. Yeah. But when it's, you know, when we feel it's ready, we'll do it. And, and having something that's not rushed, you don't have a pressure from the record company, you know, going, okay, we need this now, now, now. It comes out a lot better. I've noticed that with other bands. So, uh, you know, I know that we're really looking forward to that. How did you end up hooking up with the guys from Warrant? Uh, I was in a band called Lynch Mob, and Warrant took Lynch Mob out on tour years ago. We were friends. Uh, we stayed friends throughout the years. And it was just a chance meeting. They needed a singer. I am a singer, so it just worked out really well it's really right now it's just five guys that are loving being on stage playing for audiences you know just uh, doing it for the love of music exactly so that's great uh what's next now i mean you guys are going to be uh, hitting a couple other cities uh it's home tomorrow okay we've been like i said we've been doing these we get on planes trains vans and automobiles and scooters and segways and whatever else and just you know travel and and come in and play for thankfully great audiences yeah who just dig this stuff. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I'm a fan. I love singing it. I just want to connect with people and make them sing the words too, you know? I'll scream at them all night if they'll just do a little back. Absolutely. I mean, they, having that, that back and forth, I mean, you definitely feed off the audience that way, and it gives you a lot of energy on stage. Their energy is my energy. Absolutely. That's great. Okay. No doubt. Um, do you have any parting words before you go? Anything to tell the fans out there? Rock hard, rock often. And stay away from lightning. Don't carry golf clubs around in lightning storms. Like we're having right now. Words of wisdom. <laughs> Kick ass. Thank you. And thank you.